Hey guys, um, welcome to lesson 13. So, this lesson will be uh, working with the extrude, extruding extrusion key, and today's lesson will be ba uh, basically keeping faces together. That's what it's called in Maya. So, when using the extrude or any other tool that creates a new geometry, you have an option t in Maya to whether you want to keep the faces together or you don't. All right. Now this can really affect the way your modeling works, particularly when you're doing subdivision surface, um, subdivision uh, surface type of uh, modeling. All right. So we're going to go ahead and uh, build build um what are we going to build anything like we're going to go ahead and build a hand all right and show you exactly how this tool works so let's go into our cube um do that looks like a good hand to me yep that um make it like that all right Hit five to smooth um, to make it solid. So let's go down to our polycube that we've actually built. So want the width, okay? The width and the breadth. Um, this one, control click that one. Oh well. Um, what are we gonna do? Okay, we're gonna add uh, four to that. I think three will be enough. Let's add three to that and uh, three to that. Oh, no, no, four. Four to that. That makes sense. Yeah, that's perfect. So now um, let's click on uh, let's, let's click on uh, face. That. All right. Then go to our edit menu and click on the extrude key. We extrude that, all right. We extrude that, and um, hit the uh, the number two to smooth it. Okay, so if you look at that extrusion, it looks a bit. Let's let's extrude it some more. My thumb is a bit uh, <laughs> a bit longer than that, so uh, extrude it like that. Uh, click make sure everything is good click on extrude and increase the subdivision to make it a bit more let's see how many one two yeah two let's see how that works out yeah that's pretty good I was looking at my thumb by the way seeing how many places it bends so say so one two is, is good enough so now by instinct animal instincts because we we animals if you look at this, the first thing you think of doing is okay. Let's extrude these um, these fingers. All right. So well, animal instinct. Let's see how that how that works out for us. So shift click these bad boys, and uh, you can go up there, or I'd rather do my, my my usual extrude. All right. See that? It's keeping the faces together now. Geez, that's not what we want. That's it, that looks like <laughs> like like a fish. Someone who you probably use that hand to swim or something. That's not good. So let's uh, control Z. All right. A couple of times, I think. Yep, that's good. So control Z and go to our smooth and see that we've got keep faces together option on. We've got this option uh, checked. So let's uncheck this option and. Um, try to extrude again. See they um yeah. Let's try to extrude. Now we're talking. Now we are in business. See that? So let's go again. How many bends do I have? One, two, three. All right. So I'm going to look at my uh, divisions. Put three because my hand has three little bends thingy. Three. Well, that's perfect. Now. If we let's take it like so, if I click on this bad boy and click on the move too, are we able to move this? Oh yes, we are. Yep, we are. 
we can we able to move them and as um individuals so yeah that's um pretty much uh how keeping faces together there's a lot of things that we can do using show the, we, we can actually model this arm like that but uh, uh, modeling would take longer than using this method that i've actually used to to model a basic arm so all we have to do is do um and check uh, the keep faces together option and actually build our arm all right that took us uh, whatever three two, two minutes you know because well, the tutorial usually takes me a couple of seconds, but the tutorial I need to make sure you you're able to see what I'm doing. So now, another thing that I need to point out is um you see these faces, right? If we um okay, let's let's uh delete the whole thing, rubber band, select this bad boy and delete them, okay? Because we've done what we wanted to do. Let me just. Do create a new scene we've done what we wanted to do and now we want to build uh, something else so we do that bring it up subdivision subdivision again we pick it um, well three and this one four Yes, shade it. Click on that bad boy. Hey, face. Extrude. Yep, we're in business. Shade it. Mm. Okay, I know I'm wasting time, but I need. Not everyone else, well, not everyone watching this tutorial will be as fast as you to actually grasp exactly what I'm doing. So, you know, um, click on that one, that one, that one, and that one. Um, extrude that, uh, crap. That's a mistake that we make. Present command, poly extrude. Make sure you are actually playing with C. That now, what if we want to make a person that the what? What if we want to make a creature with hands, but with swimming hands, more like the 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 creature in um what's that movie? H Hello or something like that. I forgot in the movie the the name of the movie, but this creature was swimming. It had no more hands, but the hands were pretty much uh, like joined to make it, you know, like a duck. Um, someone giving me a call anyway. Um, so what we can do to uh to avoid this problem is to actually um control Z. All right, just bear with me. Hello. Hey Aaron, how are you? Uh, I didn't, I didn't know you. Hey guys, I'm back. I'm sorry for that. Um, I just realized I didn't have credit, so I pretty much had had to pick up the call. Sorry for that. Anyway, um, yeah. So what what we what we can do to avoid that problem is to actually uh, going to keep faces together and keep the faces together otherwise we might try to model something that we want to see, that we want to you know we want to keep the faces together after taking this option off and cause problems then we won't know how to go around it so make sure you click that back up make sure it's um, checked again then that way you'll be able to work in default you know or we can use other than uh, click on the control we can actually paint those bad boys um, then extrude as a whole yep that's um, pretty much all you need to know about uh, keeping faces together and uh, yep go to the next tutorial I hope you had fun um, oh I hope you had fun with this tutorial thank you very much talk to you bye